welcome to my channel creative art i am nilima and today we are going to do sculpture painting sculpture painting is done using sculpture paste and palette knife sculpture paste is a decorative paste which can be used to do 3d artwork to create flowers and do relief works and in today's tutorial we are going to make this beautiful sculpture painting of peonies blooming in different stages so friends do watch my complete video to make a beautiful sculpture painting yourself and do subscribe my channel friends for more creative art painting videos and do press the bell icon to get notification for each video i post every week all the materials are listed in the description box below with their links from where you can also buy them First of all, we'll start by priming our base, which is a round cut 10 into 10 inch MDF board and its thickness is about 5 mm. For priming, I'm going to use Camel Texture White. So using a flat hair brush, start priming your base in this way. Now after priming the base, we will let it get dry for at least 30 minutes. Now after priming the base, this is how it looks when it is completely dry. And here I have prepared two different colors of sculpture paste. This is white and this is purple for my base coloring. I'm also going to add a little bit of brown and olive green wherever it is required. So let's start from white first. After placing two different colors, white and purple, I'm going to mix a little bit of white with purple each time to create a shading here. Now we let it get set and dry for some time. Okay, now I'm going to add just a little bit of brown in few edges like this. So now my base is ready and this is how it looks. So now friends, I'm going to clean up my palette and then get ready for making flowers. Now after the base is completely dry, I have made a very simple drawing on my base so I can know where I want to lay the leaves and flowers accordingly. So first of all, I'm going to start by making few leaves and for that, I'm going to use yellow color and olive green color sculpture paste. Just take a little bit of yellow, take green. A lot of cream. And then I'm using a palette knife number 30112. 30112 from Brusto. Start scraping the scotch base from one side of your palette knife in this way. When you get excess, just cut it off and scrape more. Clean your palette knife and give the leaves the shape you desire. And now start placing the leaves one by one as you desire. You can give them the desired shape using brush. Here I'm using my palette knife number 1013 
and this is how it looks when I get excess on one side I'll simply scrape it off and some more and clean my palette knife Now I'm going to make a center leaf. So you're going to need left, right and a center leaf. And for that you need to scrape sculpture paste from both the sides and get very neat edge from both the sides. So this will be easy for us to place. So you have to get a very neat corner from both the sides. So this will be very easy to place. So now we'll first place the bigger leaf. I'm placing the left side now and then we place the right side and now I'll place the next one Now in the same way, I'll be making few more leaves for this flower. Now I'm going to use two different colors of sculpture paste for making our first flower. First is a light yellow and second is a old pink color sculpture paste. Here I'm using palette knife number 10 which is also Brusto number 30112. After spreading the sculpture paste, I'm going to use this palette knife and using this, start collecting sculpture paste from the tip of the palette knife so you get a fan shape petal. This is how it should look. Place it here. Now here I have got some yellow sculpture paste which I'm going to place exactly in the center in this way. Now I'm going to insert these pollens in that yellow center. So cut these pollens first and then part by part start inserting them in the sculpture paste. Take another batch, cut them using scissors. Now after placing all the pollens, I'm going to place the petals one by one. After making the first flower, let's make the second one. And for that, I have yellow color scotch paste. Just mix it very well. And now I'm using palette knife number 1013. From one side I'll start scraping some sculpture paste to make petal. So this is the shape of petal we need, a fan shaped petal. If you want you can go big and bigger, like right here. In the same way we're going to make one more petal for right side. And then I'll simply use my brush to mix up both the petals so they look like one. Okay. 
in the same way we have to keep on making petals from left and right Put in some pollens here. These are yellow color rice pollens. Now friends, I have finally completed doing my sculpture painting and this is how all the flowers look. I have also let it get dry for 24 hours and now it's time to do some relief work. And for that, I'm going to use a ceramic cone. And now I will let it get dry completely. After completing the sculpture painting, I have let it get dry completely for 24 hours. And now finally, this is how beautiful our sculpture painting looks. Friends, if you did like this painting, try watching more similar videos from the same playlist. The link is given in the description box below. And friends, do tell me in the comments below how did you like my video and if you do like my videos, Please do like, share and subscribe my channel. Thank you for watching.